Hey everyone, this is Andy from Giz China, and today we're going to look at the Elephone P9000. It just arrived with me today. Um, comes in this, in this a uh, white plastic box. It's all sealed up, and also with this delivery came a packet of accessories. Now, Elephone want to make it clear that if you order the P9000 phone itself, this is what you'll get. You'll get this white plastic case uh, and whatever's inside here. But you also have the option of buying these additional accessories. And what we'll do while we go through this. Um, hands on, we'll look at both the accessories and the Elephone P9000. So let's start with the foam first. And if I just take a look at the box itself, it's a plastic white packaging. It's a little bit similar to some of the white plastic packaging that Oppo supply their phones with. Reminds me a little bit of the Oppo N1 packaging, um, perhaps the N3, I can't really remember. And um, so obviously it's a different size, but the material, the plastic material, is very similar. Uh, this is the Elephone P9000, uh, it's the standard version, so this is the model with the 13 megapixel rear camera. Um, what else we got? USB Type-C, we have a narrow bezel design, not the bezel-less design. And it runs an octa-core Helio P10 processor in here. We've got 4 gigabytes of RAM, 32 gigabytes of internal memory, a 3000 mAh battery, we also have quick charging, and Android 6. So this is a pretty exciting phone. And you can, as you can see, it's all sealed up, so I'm going to peel this sticker off on this side, Let's pop it there, and peel this side off too. Okay, inside the box. So opening the box for the first time, you can see there's a bit of foam there to protect the phone. And this is the Elephone P9000. It's the first time I've actually seen one in the flesh. So let's just pop that out. There we go. So as you can see, it's come with a uh, protective cover on the screen. It's got another protective piece of plastic on the rear too. It feels really light to be honest. Let me just peel this off so you can have a look at the back. So this is like a sandstone finish. Not quite the same as the sandstone finish on the OnePlus 2, but very similar. You can just make out the fingerprint scanner there. It feels really lightweight. We have a look what else is inside the packaging now. So there's the P9000 phone itself. We also get a uh, simple card here which tells you about the Pump Express charge technology. We've got an Elephone quick start guide there. And there is a USB data cable. Now this is a Type-C USB. So you can see we've got this USB, Type-C USB. It's quite a thick cable for the fast charging. We've got a little tool there so we can get into the um, SIM tray, which is on the left-hand side of the phone. And anything else? Oh, and we also have a plastic silicone case, which uh, keeps the back of the phone nice and protected. All right, so that's the Elephone P9000. Those are the accessories you get with the phone as standard. Let's take a look at the additional accessories before we have a look at the phone itself. So additional accessories are a quick charger, smart case, wireless charger, and a quick data cable. So, let's have a look at those. So this is the quick charger, which is an optional extra. Comes with this uh, really thick USB Type-C ca cable, the same cable uh, that comes with the phone. So that's one accessory, this, this Pump Express quick charger. Another accessory is the Elephone wireless charger. It's quite a neat wireless charger. We're going to test that out as well. Another optional extra is this uh, curved glass, tempered glass screen protector. And we've also got this a flip case. So if I just open up the packaging. There you go. This is a flip case for keeping the front and the rear of the phone nice and protected. I'm not sure you can hear it on the video, but if you hear like a roaring sound in the background, it's actually the local army base. They're testing jet fighters just outside, which is uh, pretty cool to watch, but quite annoying when you're making a video. All right, so let's take a look at the P9000 itself. So as you can see, we've got a whole black phone. We've got black across the front here and a black rear. I, it's quite impressive, to be honest. This is a nice looking phone. It sort of reminds me of a... And like a well-made Jayu device, sort of looks like a, I don't know, it reminds me of something, I can't quite put my finger on it, but it feels 
pretty well made, and really well made to be honest. So across the front we've got this 5.5 inch Full HD display, and as you can see it's so black you can't make out where the screen and the bezels are. Um, I can tell you now that the bezels do look rather thin, and we'll see that once I turn the phone on. Got a front facing camera there, home button here on the, the chin. This is the uh, Elephone's smart button. On the side we've got power and volume rocker there on an aluminium chassis, it's a really nice aluminium chassis. 3.5mm headphone jack at the top. It's got this nice grey finish to it with a polished bevel on the rear. On the left hand side we've got this uh, function button which uh, Elephone, if I remember rightly you can set this up to do different things, uh, I guess it's used primarily as the camera shutter. So this little button here. We've got a SIM tray there which will accept dual SIM or a micro SD card. Got USB in the base, that's USB type C. Looks like we've got dual speakers but we'll have to test those. Already mentioned this Sandstone finish rear. It's not quite as rough as the Sandstone finish on the OnePlus 2 or the OnePlus 1 but it is really nice. It looks very good and it looks really well made. It's this is one of these surprise phones from Elephone. They've really ramped up their game and this does look really good. Fingerprint scanner there. Um, this is for the phase detection autofocus. 30 megapixel Sony IMX 238. Uh, was it 1238? I'll have to check, double check that. Rear camera. Dual LED flash there. Really, really nicely made. Aluminium chassis. Let me just focus on that a bit. Really well made. Looks great. It's surprising, really is surprising. There's a little bit of a rattle coming from one of these buttons. There you go, it's the volume The volume uh, button rattles a teeny, teeny bit, but not as much as some other phones. Okay, I guess you're dying to see what it looks like when we turn it on, so let's turn it on. So now, Elephone have already shown that, that this is quite a narrow phone compared to other phones, and I have to ad admit straight away in my hand, this is a 5.5 inch phone, but it feels much narrower than other 5.5 inch phones that I've tried in the past. According to Elephone and the specifications on the box, this is running Android 6. We'll find out if that's true in a moment. So just waiting for it to boot up now. So remember this is a 4 gigabyte RAM phone with a Helio P10 chipset. Okay, so we're up and running. And you can see those bezels, they are quite thin. So uh, unlike other phones that we've seen in the past which promised narrow bezels but we didn't get them, we actually do get really narrow bezels on the on the uh, LFOM P9000. The swipe up to unlock and turn that screen brightness down a tad so you can see it a little bit better. So there it is, that's the LFOM P9000 screen really is a great looking screen. Really, really good viewing angles. Nice and crisp looking. Let's have a look in the settings. So you can see that a few of the Android icons there are already a little bit different. Let's just double check that this is... Sorry, press the wrong button there. Let's just double check that this is running Android 6. So if we go down to about the phone, there you go, Android 6. Let me just turn this brightness down a little bit more so you can see it. There you go. Android 6, LFM P9000. If I tap on this, we should get, there we go. We have the marshmallow Easter egg. And we've got this little marshmallow game, similar to the lollipop game. Oops, I'm still terrible at it. Let's go out of that. And again. So Android 6.0 running on the Helio P10, 4GB of RAM, we've got a 13 megapixel camera on the rear, let's take a look at that. So Elephone have played around a little bit with the ROM, you can see it's not a stock Android installation. So if I just go back, oh, sorry, it is a stock Android installation, sorry, it's just because of the uh, wallpaper and other bits and bobs that are a bit different, it isn't stock Android. Let's have a look at that camera app. So 13 megapixel rear camera on this. Let's bring in the wireless charger here.
the focus is pretty fast. It's not super fast, but it's it's definitely not slow. And taking photos is pretty quick too. Remember, I've turned the the brightness of the screen down, so the pictures do look a little bit darker. Uh, they look okay. We'll take this phone outside in a moment, and we'll get some photos with the uh, P9000. Other features are pretty standard. It's just your stock Android 6 camera uh, application. Cool. Let's see what else we've got on here. So already Elephone have included their own Elephone application. There's also a pedometer application here too. I'll have a look at that later during the review. We've got a flashlight app. We've got a FM radio there as well. We've got all your Google services in here. We've got Google Maps. We've got Gmail. We've obviously got Google Play Store too. So I need to set all that up. Get some benchmarks running on the phone. Really have to say I'm impressed by how light this phone is. It's a really, really lightweight phone. It feels really good and compact in the hand too. And that screen is... It's all really, really impressive stuff. Let's have a quick look what this function this function uh, button does. Let's see if it's set up for the camera. No, it doesn't seem to be set up at the moment. So we need to double check in the settings to see how we use this function button. I've got to say, so far, so good. This is looking like a really nice phone. So uh, watch out for the, media the uh, Elephone P9000 review coming soon. I am going to be going traveling in the day, next day or so, so perfect timing for this to arrive. I can get some really, really good photos with the rear 30 megapixel camera. Um, before we go, let's just quickly try this wireless charger. So just bear with me one moment while I plug it in. Just give me a second, I'm just going to drag the wire over. So bring this over. Give me a second. Let's try this. So, oh, that's useful. It's a micro USB, and we've got a USB Type C plug. So, one second. Sure, I have one here. There we go. Nope, that's wrong as well. Just give me one second. Okay, there's one. So, let's plug that in here, and we should be able to see the wireless charging. And there you go, charging away. That's pretty cool. Very, very cool stuff. So that's it, that's the Elephone P9000 review. Uh, Hands-on, sorry, not the review. The review is coming soon. Helio P10. 5.5 inch full HD display, 4 gigabytes of RAM, 32 gigabytes of internal memory, NFC, wireless charging. There we go, get yeah, wireless charging. Cool stuff, very impressive. So watch out for more details of the Elephone P9000 coming soon, and also check out the full review also coming soon. Thanks for your time, and see you all soon.